And we are back in Ruth's happy place with Ruth and Bob, who's joining us this morning. All bright smiles this morning at this early hour. I Ruth, know. You've got so much going on. I mean, 16 years of flipping a home. You know, you have a show pretty much on, you know, social media. And you're also holding a book that you created, Hungry for Home. So tell us, why a book and what's behind the title Hungry for Home? I think we live in a nation that's divided and our homes are divided. So my heart has been how do you create home? I think that crosses every boundary line, every ethnicity line, religious line. So how do you intentionally create your family culture? So that's why I wrote the book and how do you use family traditions, family recipes, gardening, entertaining and decorating to use to create that and to bless people through your house. Yeah. So that's why I wrote it. You guys have really just been flipping homes for yourself, and it seems like you're starting a new tradition with your daughter, Bob. Bob again, right? Bob to the rescue. Yeah. Tell us about your most recent flip. Uh, my daughter, um, just as she graduated college, bought a house, and she asked me to work with her as she mm -hmm. brought it back down to the studs and bring we it back it. to life. And so it was allowed me to launch her into yeah. uh, owning a home that was complete and <laughs> into her married life. And speaking of married life, that was the daughter that we just saw. She yeah. got married here in the barn. Now you're planning a second wedding for another daughter. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, what are you going to do? I know, and <laughs> it's going to be here as well. So, you know, so many people think, oh, it's easier because it's at your house. It's not. Yeah. So it'll be fun to see what she brings in that's different and uh, how we can make it Avery. And you know, Ruth, we've been talking that this took some time for you guys to get here. You know, you didn't start here on the main line. You know, what would you say to people about having traditions and just starting right where they're at? Don't wait. Home isn't, it isn't about the things. It's about who you are. And it's about creating those spaces and those memories. So whether you live in a loft, whether you live in an apartment, or you have a barn, Make it about you and about the people around you. Wow. So, thanks so much, you guys, for being with us this morning.